um, would probably be strong enough to break down the house, actually. So in other words, we wouldn't want them at the house in the first place. Yeah, we don't. Because we would really just we would just make we would just make the wrong person mad. Yeah, basically, like that hydra lizard I showed you earlier. I just researched toilets. Yeah, that hydra lizard can actually break stone. Why did you not unlock? Okay. So hey, you know what? I just realized something. What? On the PlayStation 4, there's a item you can unlock called the um, uh, mirror. Mm -hmm. And the first time I tried to make it, I realized, oh, that's right. They don't care about us here on consoles, and we can't use it. Huh? Yeah, you can't even use the mirror. Why? Wow. Uh, oh, and that—that's only on console, though. Yeah, cause it, yeah, you can't use it on console, but on PC, the graphic settings exist. Yeah. Yeah. Let me see if I can find it. Are you wearing chitin armor? No, just hide. Okay. There's some chitin armor that actually looks pretty cool. <laughs> Wait, chitin armor? Yeah. Oh. Oh, okay, right, right. I, I thought you meant you were looking through. Actually, I think I do have some shit and some chests around There's here. There's fucking there? grenades. Holy shit. Yes, there are grenades, I didn't Charlie. Know there was grenades. Well, okay. Charlie, jeez. I did find something that I, that I do want to start making. What do you want to make? Beer barrels. By the way, this this brings me to another topic. Um, I'm sure many of you also watch our Minds of Insanity YouTube, and if you don't watch that, um, go what check the hell it are you out. Doing here, yeah, go go watch that now, stupid. Also, go watch me because you know the single player is much better than a, a group. Yeah, go, go watch that. Oh, right now, shit. right now it is. Yeah, yeah. That's goodness. because it's got shit we haven't seen. Um, yeah. By the way, I would like it if um. I could get a a, a pack, I, like a demo pack, to be able to test look, our server I, look, on. Look, I'm, I'm trying to get to that just as quickly as possible. Um, problem is, I'm really trying to avoid going down to my aunt and uncle's right now. Uh, well, I'm more or less my just... my uncle has the flu. I, I'm aware of this. And, um, and I, I don't want to be ill. Charlie. I'm not I'm not saying, like, upload it. I'm just saying, like, get it on, like, a flash drive or something and um, where I could get it and put it in onto the server and test it just oh, yes, for the uh, server stress test server stress yeah you, basically server stress test is is him installing his server and me setting my fat ass down on it. uh <laughs> me putting it on the server launching it with only six gigs of ram because of how much you're having to currently do with it um well, trying I'm to see if it, it actually does less I'm doing it right now with 8 gigs, but I'm also using that HD Sfax Textures. So yes. we may just have to do away with the Sfax Textures, you know. Yes, and that may be true, but at the same time, if you're because you are doing it on single player, you're also running the server. Yeah, yeah. If I could get it to run on 6 gigs and 6 gigs be overkill on, our, on my um, dedicated server, then that would be great. Well, I mean, did, did did the old server run okay with with this kind of setup? Well, it only had six gigs in total, and it did not, because it was also a slower processor, slower RAM, lot slower RAM. In fact, it was only it was thirteen thirty three, and now I actually have sixteen hundred speed RAM, and okay, I could actually what? bump this one up a lot more than what my last. I know one what did. we're gonna do. I know what we're gonna do. Throw kibbles out of my lap because she's heavy and fat. No, no, that's a not what we're gonna. I do. thought the fabricator was a train. I was getting excited. Okay. I'm like, I can make trains. Shit, I'm gonna make me no. a railroad just to fuck with you. Do you want railcraft in the next mod pack? Um, I did put it on the list, but that right there was mainly for like um just more additional stuff, not I necessarily required. But rails are useful in some situations. I mean, to be honest, buildcraft does not. I. It's an alpha right now, basically. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you Maybe... punch the shit out of me? Yeah, I accidentally left clicked. Maybe I should get out the dragon and do that. Did you just give me that left claw? 
Charlie, I will get that Hydra out again. <laughs> I will put it on the roof and just wait. Oh, it can't get wind turbines. Um, no, you can't get wind turbines. Don't worry, there's no wind on the island anyway, so don't worry about it. Really? Yeah, no. That's wind. like the one place I would think there's. I mean, fuck, look at all this grass. It's moving pretty. Okay, that's hard. that's not completely true. You get fifty percent power efficiency during the day and none at night. Okay, so there is wind on the island. Yes, it it just suck wind. Oh well. Yeah. I know what we're gonna do. Okay, Charlie, uh, you and I are gonna hop on our pteranodons. Uh huh. And we're gonna go to the redwoods. Okay. And we're gonna tame us a friggin' um, an Argentavis. And you're gonna use your cryopod to cryopod that thing up, so we can take it back here and park it till we can get a saddle for it. Because I am done uh, trying to manually halt back and forth uh, between here and the nearest major metal node uh, on this bird. Because right. while this is an awesome bird, we are never going to friggin' be able to... Get um, enough metal that way. Yeah, no, we will not get enough. We need an Argentavis, because an Argentavis can carry an Ankylosaur. Which we don't have yet, because they don't spawn close enough for me to carry one back. So, you gonna get out of your inventory and get the anchors out of your pants, or...? Yeah. I think I might be down, down to a thousand points now. Yeah. You know, it, it's... Wait, actually... I, I, I need to give you a mind wipe tonic, actually, now that I think about it. Have you unlocked literally everything? No. Well, you haven't. No, I have not unlocked everything. I've just unlocked a lot. Okay, well... I have 192 me... um, points left. But I... Okay, well, I have unlocked absolutely everything, and I have 2,416 points. So, at the end of this, after we're done recording... I'm going to need to give you a mind wipe tonic and get that fixed. Uh huh? Um, it, it's because I actually changed it where we should be able to learn everything. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, so what we need to do for starters is, um, first, you have your cryopod in your inventory. Let me check. That's, is that my inventory? Hit I. That is my inventory. Where's my cryopod? I don't have it. I did earlier. Look in the smithy. Nope. Did you burn it up? Is that possible? See what? What else have I been on? I've rode be I've rode um I've rode pterodactyl. Yes. Yeah. I haven't been on anything else. Other than I think Squirtle. I think I've got on Squirtle. There's nothing in his inventory. Well, there's 25 of something in here. That's paints and shit you made. Yeah. Um... I've just been storing my shit over there. Some of it, at least. Okay, well, obviously your cryopods have disappeared somewhere. I'm not really entirely sure where. I thought uh, I unlocked it, but I don't see it in my thing either. Uh, let me check this. How do you no. spell it? C-R-Y. Okay, no, I have not. I thought I saw me unlock it. I guess I didn't. I did unlock oh, refrigerators. I mean, I mean, make sure it isn't in your inventory. You do remember what they look like, right? Apparently, I don't. It's in my fucking inventory. It is? Yeah. Can be recharged at cryo fridge, which I don't have one of. But yeah, I have 16 we don't days have a cryo fridge because we don't have electricity, because we don't have enough metal, because we don't have enough resources. Alright, let's go. Okay. Where's the shit you at? Ha you have your cryopod, I have a crossbow. So, we're gonna have to go to the Redwood Forest, which means this is quite a fly. Great.
I mean, we can see the treetops from here, but it, it's, it's quite a long distance flight. I could make it there in this, but you're probably going to have to make a couple stops. Yeah. Unless... I've already lost you. Uh, well, okay, do you see the... Do you see the tall trees in the distance there? The really tall trees? Oh, what, the giant uh, pine-looking trees? Yeah, the giant pine-looking ones. Yeah, I see them. Go in that direction. And mind your stamina. Um, now, land it right now, in fact. Okay, well... Basically fly over the swamp and then land on the beach next to the um, giant redwood tree forest but do not go in because there is danger in those trees there's danger in these waters it's a trap no no, no. There, there's danger in the waters but not these waters what the fuck is hitting that big dinosaur there's something hit it is there's blood flying everywhere uh, that's fuck? probably a dinosuchus attacking a brachiosaur don't worry the thing will kill the dinosuchus very easily it is a dinosuchus attacking the brachiosaur yeah because dinosuchuses are very common in the swamp yeah I know that's why I'm not landing in it however there's a snake next to where I, where I do want to land don't worry. There's a bunch of snakes. Okay, that's more of a problem. I see two. But there's also a bunch of animals nearby, and they're not attacking it. I'll just go over here, summon land. Here's a nice rock. Hopefully this is far enough away from the water. Are you here yet? I'm already at the edge of the swamp next to the fort. Oh, there it is. Let's see, I'm here. Yeah. Okay, so what we're going to want to do here, and, and this is a good rule to live by here, um, is under any circumstances, do not, and I repeat this very heavily here, do not freaking go through that forest on a flyer. Got it. Go over it. Oh. I, 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 I was trying to just dash there's straight into it. there's nothing dangerous above it, go over it. I was actually trying to Is dash that... through it, but your body okay. was in my way. Okay, don't dash through it, because, and here's the thing. There are cats that cling to these trees, and you do not want to be grabbed by those cats. All yeah, right. so come join me here in this forest clearing here, where we will try to find a spot to land that will not result in us immediately dying oh by the way we were talking about how f20 is a key that's not bound to this game on my computer but yeah, every time is i start bound to, to a command in the game but it is not bound to a key you can unbind this is a very special command come land right here because it's safe well it was safe and then the bugs happened um, yeah, I bite a little, Charlie. Bite. Get the bugs off you. Um, okay, so F20 is, if I'm not mistaken, actually a key that you can bind, uh, that changes your whistle group. Huh? To, yeah, whistle groups are something for advanced big tribes that have a whole lot of tames, and they want to have synchronized and super awesome, um attack strategies that involve one person whistling multiple types of dinosaurs. Okay. Fly with me over here. The most dangerous part's over. Yeah. Uh, what we want to do is approach the mountain over here. Because A, it's got metal and it's got tr yeah. It's got metal and it's got crystal and um, there are Argentavises at the top. So just keep flying in this direction and there'll be a mountain further into the redwoods. And there's lots of Argentavises here. We could try and get a lower level one and knock it unconscious so we don't die. I gotta land somewhere pretty soon, so Yeah, yeah. Just just try and make it as far as you can. Keep keep clear of the larger trees and, and just I, I'm at the mountain at this point. 
Okay, well, I'm, uh, I'm flying I'm up. Yeah, I'm right here next to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just park it next to these stegosaurs. They're fine. That's actually what I was thinking. So I was yeah. about to say, I'm going to park yeah. next to the stegosaurs. If, if you see large herbivores just idly standing around, that means the coast is basically clear. Yeah. Can you level up your the... fucking dinosaur? Yes, of course you can level up your fucking dinosaur. No, can you? Me? I think it's yours. Yes, it says the uh, Pterodon has leveled up. Oh my god, your OCD is so Okay, I see a level 50 over It's on my screen. I see a level 50. Let's go mug em. Um, well, now here, here in lies the problem. Um, you cannot shoot from the back of one of these birds. So, if we want to effectively get this thing to huh? follow us here, there is something that will have to happen. I want you to park your pteranodon up here, where I am. Now, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to stand here, and I oh. want you to get on Skybax and pick me up with the right click after you take off. Now, don't, don't sprint. Okay, now. Um, hold on, let me remove my chibi, because he's blocking my view. Okay, <laughs> that is much better. Now, uh, you see the direction I'm pointing? This way? Yeah, there's an Argentavis down there, so get a bit low. But by the way, mind your speed, because... I'm yeah. not sprinting at all. Okay, you see that Argentavis with the orange wingtips down there? I say, we are talking about the bird, right? Yeah, the bird. Okay, you I need shot you to level me. out here. I need you to level out so I can shoot this thing from above. And then, what we're going to do is slowly fly towards the top of the mountain so we can get it away from all these raptors. Go, 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 go. Go towards the mountain top now. Keep me away from this bird, because it will kill me. This thing is a very strong bird. I know, you just have now, to tell just, me when he's close. Just move us towards the mountain top, and... Okay, you can stop moving, because he will lose his attention eventually. Okay, why did you bring him right to your pteranodon? Well... And then I just dropped you, I think, too. Yeah, you did. You just dropped me. Don't worry, we're sacrificing your Pteranodon. I feel like I have to kill him. <laughs> Please, put him down. Put him down. Hey, I'm going to put him down quick. Put him down. This is a very strong crossbow. He should be on his ass in a few seconds, really. I don't have anything to hit him, I yeah, don't think. he's on his ass. Okay. I have a club. I'll club Charlie. him. No, no! Don't club him, stupid! He's out! I know. I'll club him. I'll club him don't. down. Don't. Okay, now here's what you're gonna need to do. You're gonna need to sit here and make sure nothing attacks him while I go grab a sheep. I don't think anything is going to get to him. Charlie, saber tigers, scorpions, and uh, allosaurs yeah. all spawn on this mountain. Also, yeah. the drake also spawns on this mountain. Fuck your Drake. Does he have no, to snore I mean, so fucking loudly, though? Uh, yes, he does, because he's a big frigging vulture. What do you think? Now, hoping he wouldn't snore so fucking loud. Well, your hopes may suck the fat end of my ass. Can I not just, no, pick him up like this? No, because okay. he is a bird. So I can't cryopod him just like this? No, he's not even tame, Charlie. You oh, cryopod only... only works on tames. Yes, Charlie. Why do you think it was invented? I don't know. Not so some idiot can go knock out some animal and drag it halfway across the map. In a in a in a in a matter of a light second, too. Not really a light second. To him, it is. No, not really. Yeah, I gotta go find a sheep, and I am rapidly freezing to death, and there is a dragon here. Holy shit, what the hell? Yeah, I gotta find a friggin' sheep quick. Because if I don't, I will freeze fast. Okay. Of 
Are you friggin' kid? There isn't even a sheep up here. That's always fun. They're all back here next to you. Oh, <laughs> uh, what? Yeah, all the sheep are near the redwoods right now. Nice. I looked at the dino scanner. There's no sheep anywhere near here. <laughs> well, you got a scanner for dinos? It, yeah, yeah, because while you've been sitting there with your Johnson in your hand, basically, um, I, I've... Are you I, trying I actually, to say something? Uh, yeah, actually, yeah, I am I am trying to say something. I've beat the friggin' dragon, okay? I beat the dragon boss. So the final boss on this level, already? No, no, no. Final boss is Overseer. Okay. The dragon is a minor boss. The reason that I beat him is because I needed to be able to make a... Um, what is it called? A uh, tech transmitter. Oh. Because a so tech transmitter is extremely useful for um, scanning the entire arc for dinosaurs. Ah. It is basically how I can determine if there's something in the area that I want to tame. And then it tells me an approximate location of where it is, and I gotta go find the thing. Right. Well, in this case, it's a little annoying. Sh By the way, how's that thing's torpor looking? It's still pretty good. So whatever bird is making noise over here is giving me bad Zelda vibes. Um, so I need you to hurry the fuck up. Charlie, look, I can't... Look, I've already had enough anxiety in the last seven days to kill me. And that you was know, last why Saturday. Don't we, why don't we go ahead and air all of your dirty laundry right, right now, Charlie? Just just, just go ahead, air your anxiety right on out on the YouTube So, channel. Let's get this Saturday, all out here in the open. Last Saturday, me and Bradley went to the movie Sonic the Hedgehog. Okay, now your first mistake there was including the word Bradley in anything. <laughs> That's not what the anxiety was. The anxiety came from Sonic running with a turtle at one point, barely holding on to it. And the anxiety that he was about to drop the turtle the whole time was just you know, a lot for that, me. That actually reminds me of something cool that I saw on the internet not too long ago. What? People get so anxious whenever somebody brings an animal onto the screen mm -hmm. that they actually created a site by the name of DoesTheDogDie.com. Okay, and I feel like there's more to this story. No, that that's the whole story. Okay. Okay, son of a bitch, I'm being attacked by raptors. How's that thing's torpor looking? Is it going down? It is going down. Slowly, though, right? It's yeah. nowhere near waking up, right? No. Not even halfway yet. Okay, good, good. But no longer. God damn it, I am getting my ass handed to me by raptors every time I land out here. It is dangerous terrain. Now, if you want to see something funny, like if if you did last weekend, if, if you had wanted to see something funny, you should have saw the picture. What? Actually, I don't even know if there is a picture, a good picture of us, but you should have saw me and Bradley in the theater, just two fully grown-ass men wearing leather jackets in a movie theater. For a kid's show. And you two look like faggots. Exactly. And uh, <laughs> what's worse I is mean, we were I not the mean only... I that to be uh, offensive against the homosexual community. Uh -huh. But I mean just like literally you two look like sheer, unadulterated, flaming, queer eye for the straight guy that. Getting out of his car definitely made us look like that. Uh, but oh, oh, I the, the, mean, obviously, this is, yes, this is the worst but... part. This is the worst part. Out of 25 people in that theater, there was only four children. You Everyone know, else was grown men watching you this. You and now believe it or not, the reason on, why on, I'm still not done. This movie. Believe it or not, we were not the most faggoty looking ones there. There were some really. Uh, okay. Like, people that look like that. Uh, like, they dressed up and were sitting, walking in, some of them holding hands. So, I mean, they were just obvious. And there's nothing wrong with that. Don't get me wrong. They have a 